So the patch notes. What happened on Tuesday? Not much. Um, here you will find a listing of hotfixes that address various issues related to World of Warcraft, Shadowlands, Burning Crusade, Classic, and WoW Classic. Some of the hotfixes below take effect the moment they were implemented, while others required Schedule Realm restarts to go into effect. Please keep in mind that some issues cannot be addressed without client-side patch updates. The list will be updated as additional hotfixes are applied. Um, the biggest thing that happened with the patch was uh, cross-faction rating came back, I believe. So for achievements, uh, fixed an issue where the goal rival, challenger, and duelist arena achievements would not be granted after receiving the Season 3 uh, rating achievement. Oh, okay, so that's fixed if you're into that. Arena, your, your, your title will be given to you. This is the biggest change, cross-faction instances. Uh, cross-faction groups are can now queue up for rated PvP activities once again as intended. So cross-faction PvP is coming back. Uh, we did talk about this, guys. We might be doing some cross-faction PvP eventually in this stream. Now, I am kind of more determined right now to get AOTC. You know, I want to get AOTC and then we can start having fun with that kind of stuff. But I do think uh, uh, a rated PvP battleground where somebody on stream is calling out where to attack and where the, the flood of players should go would be kind of fun and interesting to play. Uh, Gnome and Goblin Murder Squad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we could. We could. We, would, we, might, we might have some Gnomes and Goblins in our squad. Quests fix an issue where uh, oh item rewards and and Tumbra Shadow of the Cosmos will now properly grant its movement speed bonus. Okay, fix an issue where looting journal pages would sometimes not earn uh, quest credit for treasures of Guy Cleaver, and then Torghast Tower of the Dam to help with completing Torghast achievements. Jailbreaks will now happen much more often on floor four standard wings and will happen on floor four every third floor thereafter in twisting corridors i'll be honest i probably have not done torghast i haven't done torghast maybe in two patches now i i, I ran torghast like a madman and built up enough shit that i never had to do it again so i never did the elder scrolls expansion is big time the gambling hall updates are perfection. Really, I have not seen any of that. I have not looked into Elder Scrolls Online at all or anything about it. That's that's interesting. I I watched uh who was it, it was streaming it the other day? Towley, I think. There were a couple people streaming it. You know, uh, when Elder Scrolls coming up with an update like that, they probably incentivize streamers to stream it for a little bit to try to generate some traction for the uh, for the game. And I was watching him play, and it reminded me a lot of. Um, of New World. I didn't realize that, but Elder Scrolls combat is nothing like World of Warcraft combat. 270 eye level mil. Just, just for today, Billy. Just for today. Okay, we got a fucking pumper here. Lucky one. Um, if you're close, Billy Boosted, let me know. Just put your name and server in chat and I'll still invite you. The reason why we're doing this, Billy Boosted, is because we had a perfect poll on, uh, when was the last time I streamed? Tuesday. Right? Today's Thursday? Yeah, we, I'm losing my shit. We had a perfect pull on Tuesday, but we didn't have enough DPS to get them down. We were, And we were, like, not even close. We, we were very far off. So I figured I would just pump up the item level a little bit today, try to get Ragalon down, and then come back down. It sorely needs eyes. So much better than launch. I don't know today either. Yeah, no, I'm. I'm. Uh, it looks like a good game, and El the Elder Scrolls universe to me has always been a nice one. You guys know I had to do that. You knew I had to do that, right? Yeah. So uh, Elder Scrolls, yeah, reminds me of uh, the combat. Uh, reminded me of New World, where it's very much like kind of target and, and punch kind of stuff. Just when I got my Shami to 264. Well, Res, please, you can still join. Just tell, just tell me what your guys' in-game names are. Or just whisper me if we're friends. 
uh, Dragonflight uh, Internal Alpha has it looks like it's getting started. So we're gonna we're gonna watch a quick video that Doran posted about Dragonflight and what expansion it reminds him of, and it's very interesting. So we're gonna check that out in, in a couple, uh, maybe in a minute or two here. We're gonna check out Doran's post about Dragonflight and what expansion we have recently played, maybe not so recently, that Dragonflight is starting to look a lot like. And you guys, you know, whether you like that expansion or not. Uh, I, I kind of agree with him. Dragonflight is reminding me of another expansion that we had. And uh, I personally enjoyed this expansion. I did. Not this one by Shadowlands. I mean the expansion that he's comparing Dragonflight to. Besides that, there's really not a lot of uh, WoW news going on. 